Welcome to Truly Heal and today we look at how to increase heavy metal detoxification with PMF. Over the past five years we've sold many many PMF devices to countless wellness centers, detox clinics and practitioners to help them in the process of detoxification and today I thought I'll explain to you the process, how it works and how you do it properly so that you achieve best results. Now the concept of toxins is pretty simple. We absorb them through the skin that we put on creams and cosmetics, through the air that we breathe from pollution and um, coal burning, from the water we drink, from the pesticides, from the fertilizers in our food. All of that accumulates and it's not just one big amount, it's actually many many small amounts that accumulate to a high toxic load. If we then add dental toxins, mercury, amalgam and silver to the deal then it can become an overload. Especially as a mother passes on the toxic load to the child, the child is born already with heavy metal toxicity and through generations we've accumulated more and more and that's why it's important to get rid of them. Now these toxins travel as you can see through the bloodstream and then from there they permeate into the extracellular liquid and then they dog on to the cell membrane or in some cases actually penetrate the cell membrane. And if you look at this image every cell has little receptor sites, ion channels, potassium channels, all the food channels where the cell normally takes up nutrients and excretes waste products and those membrane uh, channels that's where the um, heavy metal docks on and if you think about this as a little cell and we have a heavy metal piece, oops, a heavy metal piece floating through the bloodstream and as soon as it comes close to the cell it dogs on, it's actually attracted because the cell has a, a positive membrane potential as you can see here outside positive and then the heavy metal with a negative charge and it floats by and it's attracted and it dogs on to those ion channels that you can see here in this lipid profile. Now as soon as they block that the cell can't take in any nutrients anymore and that's a big problem because that causes the cell to starve, to deflate, to lose energy, to have lack of um, ATP production and that's what we don't want. So the next problem is if the heavy metal goes inside the cell that's where it destroys the mitochondria, where it influences DNA repair and DNA reproduction which causes then mutations and what we know cancerous cells and that's why heavy metals are actually known to be carcinogens, toxins that cause cancer because they mutate the cell. Now as soon as we put exercise into our body and we move and we jump and we move our body that's how we throw out toxins and then sweat and that's how the body naturally would detoxify. Every kind of movement, muscle movement, lymphatic movement would then help with the detoxification process. If you then have enough binders like ACZ for example, zeolite that binds to heavy metals it would then excrete them properly. But the problem is from a certain age on we just reduce that bouncing and jumping and exercising too much and that's why our cells start to deflate and reduce energy and take on more and more and more toxins which then causes to diseases and degenerative diseases. Now an alternative to that is PEMF and when you look at PEMF in itself it's actually a beautiful treatment. When we look at here this Curatron device which is a very small very light device that many have and even take with them on a journey and we turn it on then you can see here on this button, let me just check if I've turned it on, no, okay, we choose program and now we turn it on and now you can see here on this cushion we have actually a vibration, a magnetic vibration and you can see it moves this little magnet quite intense, it's bouncing around and it's jumping and I have a hard time to hold it still. So any kind of heavy metal in your body would react to a magnetic field and that's what we notice. 
And that's why when you use it, see how they attract each other? That's how they are shaken loose. Now let me just try, very short. I just put three together of those little molecules because one just jumps away and I put them on here and you can see they're jumping around on that little cushion and that's exactly the effect that we have as soon as we put heavy metal in the area of pulsing magnetic fields. They're rattled loose. And this is what you will notice in your body. All the toxins are released and shaken free, wrong way, shaken free from the cell. And all of a sudden they are in the extracellular liquid. But the problem is you turn the device off and bang, they are immediately bouncing back to the cell. And that's when you have a Herxheimer reaction. All the toxins that have been stored are released and then they cling on in different areas of your body to fresh cells. And then you feel nauseated, you feel uh, not very well. Now another way to do that, instead of the oscillating frequency which vibrates it loose, you can shake, and this is why these are clinical models, they have a lot stronger magnetic pulse. If I turn that on, and I turn on the pulse, you can see it actually causes muscle contractions. It's a huge magnetic wave that is shot into my body and it rattles free all toxins from all cells at the same time. And these devices are extremely effective in their results in heavy metal detoxification. But because they are so expensive, usually used in clinics, whereas these devices and the little DCM 3500 are used in clinic environments where you or home environments where you can afford that a lot easier. Now, the next step is probably the most crucial and really note that down. If you start to detoxify with any kind of exercise or with PMF, you want to have plenty of binders in your body. Now binders are very simple. They are long chain molecules like modified citrus pectin, like zeolite or clay, magnetic clay, and they bind immediately to those heavy metals. As you can see here, as soon as they are set free, they cling on to them and then they render them neutral, harmless. They actually attach themselves so that you can then urinate them out or you can uh, detoxify via the colon and poo your heavy metals out instead of reabsorbing them. And that's why this is such an important process. So when you start thinking of using PMF or exercise for detoxification, always prime your body. This is a very convenient way. I have that on my desk. And it's very simple. I just spray four or five times into my mouth. And I do that over the day four or five times with nanoparticles of zeolite and they attach to heavy metals. In the morning you drink your little edible clay, a glass, and you drink that and prime your body. If you take chlorella, for example, you absorb plenty of those binders that attach. Modified citrus pectin is another one. So they are just the standard binders that we recommend everybody to take two or three days before prime your body so that when you start using PMF that they are not reabsorbed and reattaching to the cell but actually are excreted out of your body. Now the next step that we need to look at are minerals. You can see as soon as those toxins are flushed out from your ion channels, all of a sudden your cells are starving for nutrients and would like to take up the nutrients that they are designed to take up, which is, and I just go through very short, here in this image, mercury, blocks, zinc, selenium, iron and iodine. So very important, you want to, as soon as you detoxify mercury, you want to have healthy levels of selenium, zinc, iodine and iron in your body. If you have arsenic poisoning and you detoxify that, you want to have zinc, magnesium and selenium in your body. And you can read all the rest underneath. We put all the charts so that you have them available. But that's why detoxification is also associated with a very good mineral content and uptake. And we put a test um, um, link underneath where you can order the link where they do the test 
and they check your mineral status and your toxic status and you even get a consultation with the laboratory to find out what best to supplement in order to detoxify. So as you go through I would just like to mention magnesium. The, the softness of your membrane and the ion channels that hold the toxins is actually dependent on magnesium. Low magnesium cramps and stiffness and pain, high magnesium levels, everything becomes smooth, you sleep a lot better. So increasing magnesium uptake through either a transdermal massage of magnesium oil or like I like most the magnesium flakes you put into a hot bath, you lay into it, you absorb all the magnesium will increase your detoxification manifold and that's why this is one of the things priming your body with binders and giving you yourself enough magnesium so that your body can let go of heavy metals. Then together with the doctor I would check your selenium, zinc and iodine levels and then the next step would be to drink plenty of water. Do it before the treatment, do it after because Water is the solution to pollution. You want to get rid of all those heavy metals in a very fast way and that is drastically increased by having mineral rich water that you drink to the treatment. All right, now let's just look very short at the different treatment modalities. The Curatron device is a very easy to use, very affordable device that you can use with a coil or you can use it with a full body mat or pad and it has enough power to shake loose toxins. Now when you look at the power of those devices, there is many multi-level marketing devices which have very little power and they don't penetrate the body deep enough to shake loose those toxins. Whereas if you look here, this is a very, very strong magnetic pulse that you can see even works on a higher distance and I can still feel the movement here very strong whereas on those low power devices I wouldn't. And that is something that a lot of people don't know. Measuring 100 gauss or 50 gauss or 1000 gauss directly at the pad is well but then we decrease by distance squared. So if we go up two inches we have already just an eighth of the power, a sixteenth of the power and it goes a thirty-tooth which is then really hardly anything and that's where the earth magnetic field outside is probably stronger than the pad that you have. That's why you want very high power in order to detoxify properly. Now that's number one. The second piece would be the DCM which is a really handy tool. It comes in this little suitcase that you can take easily with you wherever you go. It has a nice carry case, it's waterproof. You can put the applicator into the lid and then you take that with you wherever you go. It has a low power, which is the same as the Corotron. It has an oscillating frequency, which is soothing. It helps you relax, it helps you fall asleep. It energizes the body, but it's very, very mellow. And then you have high power 15 or high power 5 minutes and that's where you have the same pulse as with these applicators. You can just plug that in. Oops, you should turn it off before you unplug. You just plug the same applicator in to this device and then you pulse those big shock waves into the body to get rid of toxins. Now this one comes up to 3500 gauss which is a very powerful tool for detoxification. The next level up would be the PT, uh, uh, PMT Digital which then has massive grunt. This is one of the strongest digital PMF devices on the market and it produces up to 7000 or 10,000 gauss depending on the applicator that you use. And this is where you can achieve very fast detox in clinics and in a very short time. So this is because of the price usually used in wellness centers and in clinics. And then we have the old-fashioned style spark chamber PMT 120 which you well know which is worldwide known as one of the most powerful PMF devices to detoxify and even kill off cancer cells in a very strong manner as a localized treatment or as an overall treatment for detoxification. Right? Now one thing 
and I don't want to stop this video on anything else but those binders. Do not forget to prime your body with binders before you start PMF for detox because the amount of heavy metals that are flushed out you don't want to reabsorb them. You want to bind them and then eliminate them out of your body. Thanks for listening and we'll see you in our next training video.